this is Andrew and welcome to another video about the server stuff. This is uh, HP storage work uh, D2700. As you may see here. It has a 25 base for the 2.5 small form factor hard drives. I put it uh, 10 drives already in. It is a uh, one six gigabyte six G hard drives and you may see it's got a little bit dusty but just a small overview. Let's go to the back and see. <coughs> it has two power supplies, the redundant fan, this is one, this is two, this is small panel for the control sets. And it has two uh, internal RAID arrays for the hard drives. You can actually just plug one, so it will work without any problems. If you have one and two, there will be the lighting with the number one, two. You can connect to the four of these enclosures to the same controller if you have. And this is an external uh, port for the SAS. It was. 8,088 uh, if I remember correctly. This came for the management, but it will work only from the manufacturing, as there is in uh, specification about it. It has a hot plug power supplies too. They came with 460 watts too. They just for redundancy. Fan is too. Hot plug is quite long. They have two two semi turbine fans lower. And there, of course, is a special so has some filler so the airflow can still go while you have unplugged the fan. And uh, there is a small button. Up here to press it, and then you can release it. This one better. It's hard to do with one hand. You can release it. They are two same series HP branded with the label made in China, as always. So now let's see what there is inside. As I can ensure there is not much inside. Just a simple that. There is some good information about how and when to do it. This is a board name for the redundancy hard drives they have the screw drive in hiding and this is a cable management this is the back plate of the 25 hard drives this is a small label there too so this is almost all so thanks for watching do subscribe to my channel if you like some of my videos. Thanks and see you later. Oh, and I forgot to mention if you want to see how it works. I put it back cover now. And just the cable in like this. Just plug one to see. You just need to press this button for about five seconds. It's loud as hell.
it will get more loud when you will work with the hazards because they got heat heated. I do not know in server because there is no controller who control them, so that's fine. This is the only way to shut down it. <laughs> 